So hi everyone, in this video, I'm gonna see how far I can go on my 2020 free ride EXC after the battery dies. So if you're wondering what I'm talking about, after the battery dies, the bike should be dead, right? Well, that's not necessarily the case. You can let this bike rest for a few minutes with the power off, turn it back on, and there's still a little bit of juice left to get you some distance. So what I'm gonna do is ride this bike until it dies initially, and then wait a few moments, probably two to three minutes, turn the bike back on, and then see how far I can go. Probably be doing that several times in this video. It's 31 degrees out today. Let's get the bike started. Looks like we have a full charge. Turn these gloves on, these are really nice. Nothing like riding an electric motorcycle with electric gloves in the middle of winter. Okay, we have full power. I take that back. We have a flashing red light indicating 80% power. I'm going to switch this to mode three. There we go. It's so mode three, 80% power. And I want to drain this battery as quickly as I can. And already my goggles are fogged up. So maybe once I get moving, they will defog. Oh my goodness. Went 14.8 miles. Battery's now dead. Nothing. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna turn everything off and set a timer. And we're gonna wait this out. Turn it back on, see how far we can go. And in the meantime, I'm gonna sit here and let people drive by and wonder what the heck I'm doing. So one of the reasons for making this video is that I know there's a big concern that people have about the range of these bikes, which is a valid reason. They, they definitely don't go as far as a gas bike does. But I just wanted to show you that if you are out and about and, and uh, you run out of battery some distance from your vehicle, you can at least limp back a little bit. So I waited three minutes. I'm going to reset the trip meter. Let's see how far I can go now. There we go, got a little bit left. See if we can take it a little while. All right, it died on me for the second time at 0.4 miles. And uh, of course the battery's dead. So I'm gonna turn this off, let it sit about five minutes this time. Come back and see if it'll go any further and get some gloves on. So it's been five minutes since I turned the bike off. Turn the power back on and see how much battery we have. Again, so far we've gone 0.4 miles. And throw my gloves on. And I'm just gonna stick to the gravel driveway here. Five miles died on me again. Let's try this one more time and then I'll end it after that. Turn the bike back on. There we go. So I made it half a mile so far. See how much further we can go. So I made it 0.6 miles, I'm gonna call this one done. So just to summarize this video, after the bike died initially on a dead battery, 
let the bike sit for about five minutes. I did this three times in a row, went a total of 0.6 miles. So just to compare this, I did this one in the summer. It was about, I'd say between 85, 90 degrees. Got the same results. I had to let the bike sit a little bit longer. So there you have it. Hope you enjoyed the video and take care.